Warzone Mobile had one of the worst global launch in mobile gaming history. Warzone Mobile rating on Play Store is as low as 1.6 star and to be honest it is one of the worst rating I have seen in my entire life. I have never seen any game with 1.6 star rating and considering Warzone Mobile was so hype and everybody was thinking it is going to be the next big game after PUBG Mobile or Free Fire or Card Mobile. But when they launched it globally it had a lot of problems, optimization for Android was very bad and a lot of other stuff as well. And now a lot of players think that it might get shut down just like Apex Legend Mobile. So in this video we are gonna talk about is there any chance that Warzone Mobile is going to shut down. Before that let's talk about U4GM. They are pro and legit web provide Warzone Mobile service. They have professional boosters which can help you to get all the hard challenges and make challenges easily done. Meanwhile you can top up official 60% off CP points and cheap card redeem code as well. Once I try use my redeem code AGFOREXTRA 5% off you will find the link in the description. Let's talk about why Warzone Mobile Global Launch was such a disaster. So the first reason was they delayed the game a lot. The game was expected to be launched in 2023 but they keep delaying it and as they were delaying the game a lot of people think that delaying the game is a lot better than releasing a game unfinished. So they were just hoping that whenever we got the chance to play Warzone Mobile it will be fully optimized. So finally when they released it on 21st March it was not optimized for Android devices. It was very bad, the game was crashing a lot, heat issues. The game was running very bad even on high end devices as well. And I think one of the reasons that the game was not optimized was because they didn't test the game for uh, poor countries. The soft launch was for Sweden, Norway, Australia, Chile and Germany. These are the countries where people have good devices especially iPhones because it's very cheap to buy iPhone there. I mean it's not cheap but they can afford iPhones quite easily as compared to Asian people like Pakistani, Indians, Bangladeshi. And considering we have a lot of gamers in Asia as compared to Europe or America or any other country. So they didn't test the game in any poor country so they were just testing the game in rich countries where people use like uh, iPhones and other devices. And when they test the game on iPhones or any high-end Android devices they thought that the game was finalized, the game was ready to launch. And when they launched it a lot of low devices player tried the game and the game was very bad on their devices. They were getting like 10 to 15 FPS it was literally unplayable. So then they go to play store and give it one star rating. It's not their fault, they were expecting a good game but the game was very disastrous. So now the question is, is there any chance that Virtual Mobile is going to shut down? To be honest, I don't think so they are going to shut down Virtual Mobile. Even though they are currently working on improving the game and optimizing the game for Android devices, maybe in next one or two updates we will see some improvements. But I don't think so they will be able to completely fix it in one or two months, it will take time. And doesn't matter what happened, they are not going to shut it down. There are a lot of reasons it won't shut down. One of those reasons is that the overall gameplay or overall game is not bad. The game is literally better than any BR I have played. It's enjoyable, it's fast paced, it's like a lot better than PUBG Mobile or COD Mobile or Free Fire or any other BR game you have played. The only place where they were lacking was optimization and I think it is possible to optimize the game. It is not possible to change the mechanics of the game just like in COD Mobile the BR was not good. It was not in terms of optimization but the overall BR experience was not very good. So it is still not very good to this state has been 4, 5, 6 years maybe. But the overall game experience of Warzone Mobile is a lot better and the only thing they need is optimization and they are currently working on it. And I think they will be able to optimize the game in next 2 to 3 months. It will take some time and don't expect them to fix the game in 1 or 2 updates. It definitely takes time to optimize the game for every Android. The game is optimized for iOS devices. iOS devices doesn't have much issue. You might face some heat issues and some frame drops but it's, it's playable. At least it's playable but on Android it's completely unplayable. They just keep adding and removing graphic options. They are trying different methods. Somehow they want to make it work on Android devices. Even though they have lowered the minimum requirement to play Warzone Mobile which does not make sense because it's it's just not running on the high-end devices how they are like lowering the minimum requirement. But anyways, uh, this should answer your question that Warzone Mobile is not going to shut down. And I will meet you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.